All right, time for Taurus. Three of Cups. It looks like finding like-minded community is the next step for you in terms of pursuing yourself. So are there are there people in your life who have been hitting you up to hang out with that you haven't hung out with yet, that you know that you have some like interests, or maybe there have been some things, some hints that you have some stuff in common in terms of what you desire for your life, desire for your future, or um, what makes you happy and feel abundant and all of that. Anybody who has been an opportunity for you to hang out with that kind of seems aligned with a deeper part of yourself, you need to spend time with those people. Joining together in groups, this is a way to enact the fact that you are more aligned with yourself by attracting different types of people into your experience and being able to understand that you know, maybe logically in the way we think about things, it's not all on the same level, but what we desire and how we like to fill our cups up, this we have in common and this we can share. And when we share that, we have more abundance to go around. When I'm more fulfilled, I can bring more to my relationships and my friendships and I can contribute to them feeling more fulfilled. When people have less to offer, I have something to give. And in that kind of state of reciprocity, you know, we can all kind of uh, engage in um, a tripling of our abundance by combining our forces. And it's this exponential power of finding like-minded community. And the way to like really deepen Taurus, your relationship to the universe and yourself is by extending outside of your comfort zone of just creating a safe space within your own emotional spectrum and within, within your own home and branching out and putting yourself into more situations in which, you know, other people's will is going to maybe fly in the face of yours. But to recognize that even if our conscious wills, you know, we don't all want the exact same things. If we are spending time with people, we can clearly see, want emotion what we want out of relationship, out of community, out of life, then we are going to learn more and more about ourselves by having that diversity of experience, being pushed outside of our comfort zones for the sake of communion, community, and connection. Again, sometimes the way to interface with ourselves more deeply is to figure out that like, you know, there's so many other people with completely different backgrounds and different, you know, ideas about life who at the end of the day want the same things we do and are filled up in a lot of the same ways. And Taurus interfacing with that is a way to see themselves in a much deeper way and relate to the other because, you know, Taurus is a very physical, it's a very fixed earth sign. And its biggest calling is to transcend into that spiritual awareness where it's like, uh, you know, I'm not the only one here and I'm not the only one who has these values and my way is not the only way to live a life. And, you know, the things that fulfill me, what I think about in terms of what I need to do to pr like pursue those things is not the only way to go about getting those needs met. And we learn that through, you know, spiritually expanding ourselves through that diversity of connection with the different people in our communities, especially when we know that we all get fulfilled in the same ways. And you find those like-hearted communities, at least. It doesn't even have to be like-minded, but similarly, you know, fulfilled in similar ways is really what we're aiming at here. <laughs> 